Well, Ford has finally released the ability to adjust the speed of your AC charging rate on your Ford electric vehicle. So today, what we're gonna do is show you where to go to make that change in the vehicle and on the Ford Pass app, and also discuss a small caveat to this and why your vehicle may or may not have this feature. Let's dive in, hit that subscribe button, and let's take a look. All right, everybody, welcome back to Tech Motoring. So Paul here with another episode, and this one's about specifically the Ford Mustang Mach-E and the Ford F-150 Lightning. Now, being a Ford Mach-E owner for over three years now, one of my biggest gripes with owning that vehicle was never having the ability to adjust the AC charging speeds. Now, this could be good for a multitude of reasons. If you're at someone's house and you want to plug into a charger, but you don't want to pull the maximum speed, you want to adjust it by the car so you don't either trip a breaker, you don't want to charge the car as quickly because maybe you are you know, want to charge it where it's 100% right when you wake up the next morning as opposed to it you know hitting 100 percent at midnight so there's a lot of different reasons as to why you would want to slow down your charging rate and everybody kind of has their reasons as to why but the fact that the ford mustang Machi -E and the ford lightning have been missing this feature for years is beyond me well ford finally fixed this issue and they have released the ability to finally adjust the speed of your ac charging in your Ford vehicles, your Mach-E and your F-150 Lightning. And today we're gonna to show you how to do that. However, there is one caveat to this new feature, is that it is currently only available on the 2025 Mach-E and F-150 Lightning. I do not know why that is the case, but Ford has limited it to just those two vehicles in that one particular model year. So being a Mustang Mach-E owner with a 2021 Mach-E, I do not have this functionality. However, my recently purchased 2025 F-150 Lightning does have this feature. So in this video, we're going to show you how to get to it, how to adjust it from not only the vehicle, but also from the Ford Pass app. And then this way, if you have a 2025 F-150 Lightning or Mach-E, you can make these adjustments as well if needed. So let's dive in and take a look and see exactly what needs to be done. All right, everybody. So here we are sitting in the Ford Pass app. And as you can see here on the screen, we have my F-150 Lightning. Now, from here, it's actually very simple to get to the charging AC adjustment. You can just go into the energy tab at the very bottom, click on that. And then from here, you can see AC charge rate under the advanced menu there. Click on that AC charge rate. And here you can see you can adjust the speed of your charging in five amps all the way at the bottom. And you can actually adjust it in what appears to be uh, basically one amp increments all the way. So really good functionality here. It's not just like a low, medium, high. It's actually like a full on, uh, you can adjust it at one amp increments. So really good to see. Uh, the only other car that I know can do this incremental would be like the Teslas. So that's really cool to show that they actually have that. Now, of course, there could be some limitations to this based on, you know, your charger and stuff, but really cool to see that you can adjust it from there. Now let's dive into the on-screen computer of the car and see how it looks there. All right, now it's just as easy to get to it from here in the F-150 Lightning, or once again, if you have a Mach-E. So what you're gonna do is, Typically, you would think you would want to go into the settings here and it would be here, but it's not actually here. You actually have to go into this menu here and click charge settings. So once you click charge settings, you'll see this menu here where you can make some you know differences in your charging, like your charging uh, target. So you can adjust your target in here, your departure times, charge times, whatever. And then we have this advanced menu. When you click on this advanced menu here, that's when you see that you can now have the adjustment for AC charge rate. And once again, same rules apply. You could come down here all the way to five amps 
and adjust up accordingly based on your needs, whether you're home or whether you're, you know, you don't want to overload your, you know, your solar output of your house, or maybe you are at a friend's house and you don't want to overdraw, you know, their NEMA 1450 circuit. So you can make the adjustments right here in the vehicle itself, which is really nice as well. And so that is how to make the adjustments in the F-150 Lightning and Mach-E. All right, everybody, well, that is it. So those are the very simple and easy ways to adjust your AC charging rate in your 2025 Mustang, Mach-E, and Ford F-150 Lightning. So I hope this video helped you out. If it did, make sure you hit the thumbs up below. So make sure you like the video. Subscribe to the channel if you're new to tech motoring here. And if you're interested in any Ford Mustang Mach-E content or F-150 Lightning content, make sure you go back and take a look at some of our videos that we've done in the past. Thanks again for watching today's episode, and we'll see you on the next one.